class, I'm going to give you a butchered handout that was meant to be both on one side, but got a grid on one side and your name and date on the other. We're going to roll with that. Dang, oh, dude. dude. Printers, they smell <laughs> fear. <laughs> All right. Here's what I'm going to have you do. I'm going to have you number the rows one to three. Mm. And then the first column is going to be labeled what we did. Oh, shoot. Wait a second. And then just raise your hand when you're ready, or when you're done with that. So, like, what is column one, we is column two, and did is column three? No. First I, I don't speak Italian. First column is titled what we did, right? What we did, yep. Oh, okay. Just okay. Okay. <laughs> yep. All right, and is everyone ready now? From in row wall, in row one, column one, I'm gonna have you write in what we just did. Just what we just did. Just for not. You. Don't quote me. Just what did we just do? Okay. okay. <laughs> I'll play the game. <laughs> All right, and now I'm going to have you pair up with your partner right next to you and just quickly share what you just did. Um, I just wrote the chart. All right, cool. Yeah, we're doing good. I was going to ask us how you do that, and I was like, No, yeah, I definitely messed up. There's a moment. All right, as you wrap that up, I'm going to make a quick apology. I don't. I didn't really have a clear procedure for you, so some of you were really confused on what to do. <laughs> no! Now, <laughs> now, you should be pairing up to talk about what you're writing down. Now I'm going to move on. In your second column, I'm going to have you write, how clear was the task? And then, when you're done with that, I'm going to have you fill in the second row and the second column. <laughs> and don't get tear up and chair. Wait, what? Wait, what are we supposed to put in the second row and so the second column? Second row and second column. Just fill it in as it's. Uh, this is row two, and we're on the second part of it. So the second thing we just did, you're going to write that down, and you're also going to fill in the second column for <laughs> why or how clear was the task? With words. Wait, I, I just did mine in the pictures. Is that okay? <laughs> if you can share it and explain it, I'll accept it. <laughs> that sounds good to me. I thought it would be like this. There's a second row. Whoa! Second rows and second I column. See. But that will go. I don't know how that's working. Yeah, we never use Excel. Yeah, you can work rows and columns. <laughs> I do, but <laughs> I keep missing like the first part of the direction. I'm really confused myself. Has everyone shared with their partners? Yeah, we got it. <laughs> All right. <Yeah. laughs> yeah. Here's our third task in your third row. Third task, third row. Oh. Got it. <laughs> I'm going to have you do three things. One, you're going to write on top of the third column why, or, why were or were not the instructions effective. The second thing is, you're going to fill in the rest of your grid, the entire thing. And three, you're going to discuss with your neighbors why you put what you did for the entire grid. Not effective? Why it was or was not effective. Oh, I did a goof. Classic, bro. Yeah, you know me. <laughs> 
I'm jealous of your star, Dan. Yeah. Maybe you like, yeah. Be great. It's actually not mine. This one from one that I shared. I don't know how to give the content then. <laughs> Classroom participation. <laughs> um, okay. <laughs> drug campus all over it. Can I ask a non routine specific question? What strategy was this? You'll see. Okay. I'll play it. Has everyone shared with their partner what they wanted to? Okay, let me make it clear. Raise your hand if you've shared with your partner what you wanted to. No. Wait. Then why'd you? <laughs> Please share with your partners. Okay. Oh. Okay. So. Um, what is the goal? Yeah, exactly. Uh, like no logical order. I don't know. That's what I thought. And no example. You're supposed to go with the last three. My column three. Oh, it would be. Right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. I never even said that. Because you said I'm not a follower. Three put uh, this way. This is like you said. This is I can tell it looks like a bird. Oh, 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 and just a reminder, raise your hand when you're done sharing. More, more clear. I think we're good. Still. Okay, good. Everyone. All right. Now, that was confusing. Yes. It was meant to be. I know. Glad you caught on. <laughs> now I'm going to go through some vocab quick with you because I want to be able to talk with the, about this with you without co going into a bunch of ums and ahs and it was like this but not like so. We have a few different types of routines. Our first one is lesson running routines, second one is interaction routines, and our third one is classroom running routines. Our lesson running routines are just routines that dictate how the lesson will be run. And let me know when you're ready to go on to the next slide. Just put the hand up in there. I'm down. All right. Our interaction routines are rules for how we're interacting with each other. This is stuff like, hey, I have a question. Or... I might be telling you to share with your partner every other task. Our third one is classroom running routines. This is how we dictate classroom behavior or just organizational things. How do we pass out papers? Do I just throw them on the table? Do I have you, uh, do I hand it to you one by one? Stuff like this. There we go. Now. Oh, right, yes. Now, though, you're not ready? No, I'm good. Okay. <laughs> they both saw our hands get raised and thought it was a question. So <laughs> <I did. laughs> All right. Now that we have these vocab words, what was going on? When? For all of the grid activity, what was going on? Thanks. Good question. <laughs> <laughs> We were confused by the words you were using, and so we didn't know what to do. Hey. That's a good way to put it. Um, I also noticed, based on what we did for the reading, that at one point in the beginning, you intentionally went, like you stopped your instruction. You said, oh, by the way, you guys, at the start of this, I didn't give, give instructions well, so I'm sorry, but let's keep going to what we're doing. So you're mm -hmm. hopping around like we were doing in the reading, or like the reading. Mm -hmm. and let's just go down the line. One quick thing. Um, rows and columns were very confusing. And like as you're saying them, I was like, the labeling and like where we're supposed to label. Filling in columns and rows, like using that exact terminology, is very confusing. I had no idea what was going on. 
Yeah, uh, Hannah brought up that there wasn't an example being used, so it was hard to know what was expected. All right. Those are all really good points. Now, I'll be really honest with you. I was not planning on the grid being this confusing. You're supposed to get it after, like, the second <laughs> task. You did it too well. <laughs> too well, too well. Now, I've disrupt I purposefully disrupted each type of routine. Now, I'm going to have you take a few minutes, discuss with your pairs which ones were they, and how did I do it. That's not me being ready as a question. Yeah? Um, can you put the definitions for those back on the board? Uh, they're in each in a separate slide, so do you want me to just jump to a specific one? Oh, never mind. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's talk about class in one. I know, I know. The trickiest one I feel like is going to be classroom. Makes sense. I think, so, like, I think that has to do with the raising hands. Like, are you asking the question? Interaction, whatever we start doing. I guess there are the interactions, but really, what you have rules. Also, the whole hand raise for comprehension checks. Yeah. Really confusing because, like, the interaction for your hand raise being raised is you're about to ask a question. Absolutely. So, I don't know if that's intentional or not. This is not like the first Like, gave the instructions. And then disconnected. Yeah, yeah. Well, dropped off some instructions and then instructions were pulled back. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't know if that would count. I'm going to be yeah, honest with you. I think at one point, one thing I, I didn't notice for the lesson that, like, like, there's some like ding dong like, ditch instructions. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. It, you're so lost that you just kind of like should resign yeah. out of there. Yeah. Take a step back. Yeah. Um. Uh. All right, it's sounding a bit quieter now. Does, is everyone ready to share as a whole group what they think they were? I'm going to take that silence as a yes. I'm seeing some grimaces. It... Yes, no? Yeah, we Not haven't really. discussed all of them. All right, I'll give you more time. I'll give you another minute. All right, thank you. The Gemma move right there. <laughs> um, Let me get my timer up. Yeah, for that, but... Okay. Well, so moving like to like the second so, activity yeah. part of the last before we really knew what we were doing. Yeah. Like mm -hmm. um, I guess maybe like the interaction one, like when we talk about it. Asked, what was the last one? Instructions? Yeah. Um, I don't know. Someone like, 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 I thought he was like, just going to say, like, you know, like, get off, like, fill it in. <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking. Like, they talk versus, like, yeah. Okay, <laughs> I was thinking it was, like, like one of those, mm -hmm. have you ever heard the worksheet where it's, like, first thing it says, do not write anything until you reach the end. And then all it wants you to do is make a smiley face, but if you don't read the whole thing, you have to do everything. I thought it was going to be something like that, so I was like, fill it in. <laughs> All right, uh, let's wrap up our thoughts, and I feel like you probably got at least one of each in each group. Let's have one. Group one. Um, for classroom running, we weren't sure. You said that one was going to be difficult, and so we kind of decided last minute, like, the way you handed out the papers. First, you handed one to a student, and then you just, like, tossed the rest of the stack at the next student. I couldn't tell if that was intentional or not. To try that to was them. not, but that is a good point yeah. where it was not a strong routine. Yeah. Uh, for interaction, we thought hand raising was kind of confusing, so it disrupted the interaction in the group. And then for lesson running, we just said uh, the vocabulary, like columns and rows, we're talking about like not, not everybody knew what that meant, so it would have helped to have like a quick guideline before we started using the chart. All right, that is very humbling because none of those were what I intended. <laughs> <laughs> all right, next group. Um, but yeah, they were all true. Sorry. Did we need one for each or just, I mean, they did. I was intending one from each group, but oh, as many okay. as you got, bring it. There. Okay, um, I guess we were talking about interaction routines of like the routine for like when we were supposed to talk as a partner group, and then like 
to signal that we were done doing that. I feel like that could have been a little more smooth than you just like saying, oh, now talk. Okay, now talk, you know. Yeah. All right. How about Hannah and Kyle? <laughs> okay. Uh, so, yeah, classroom learning, um, we mentioned the raising hands thing also. Um, where, yeah, just uh, raise our hands when we were done with things, but also that can be used for like asking questions. Um, interaction, didn't fully explain the instructions. Uh, people had questions, those weren't really answered completely. Um, and then the lesson running, we felt like the pacing was off. Uh, we moved on to like the second part before we really knew what we were doing with the first one. So, yeah. <clears throat> All right, uh, yeah, those are all good answers. Here's what my intentions were. The tricky one was the fact that I sat over here today and I always sit over there. Ah. Oh. I didn't know. I noticed that right there. I noticed that, that, that too. I. Yeah, and I know some people came in the room a little, oh, what's going on? But no, interaction one, everyone got that one. Do we raise our hands when we're ready to do it? How do we interact? When do we interact? Lesson running, that kind of goes into interaction, but the directions were not clear, and so you didn't know what to do. And you got slightly more comfortable as the lesson go went on, but not as clear as I would have liked. Mm -hmm. Now, what routines have I established? Um, raising our hands when we're ready. Yeah. I found myself doing that like. When you're like, are we all good? I'll just go mm -hmm. <laughs> Nice. Um, working with our partners. Mm -hmm. That's another good one. Even just the definition of like, who exactly is my partner? Is that Hana or is it Colleen? Mm -hmm. So we got to kind of like that too. All right. Any, anything else people want to add? Good? Raise your hands. <laughs> <laughs> got it. <laughs> All right, now here's the best part. How can we apply the what we just learned to our teaching? I know it's a really broad one, so if you, feel free to take a minute, but it's only going to be about a minute. Um, make sure that we establish clear routines for all of these. Perfect. Use examples or like uh, demonstrations when Teaching. Absolutely, exactly what I should have done. <laughs> Something that I never. Well, go good. No, you're okay. Sorry. <laughs> so, like, because this is such a specific activity, like, if you were going to teach something like this, this would not be a normal thing you'd probably use. So, it's really interesting to think about how, even just day to day, you have to establish routines of how specific activities are going to be run. Mm -hmm. Also, think um, like explaining directions like multiple times. Like, I've even realized that, and like. A seventh grade classroom, like they need to hear it like multiple times, or else you'll get like 85 questions about like how we're supposed to do this. Hmm. Anything else? All right, I think that really wraps up what I have, and thank you. Was that discovery learning? That was discovery That's learning. Okay. All right.